Very concerning situation. Eight on your side is following it closely. Cleanup efforts are popping up nearly every day now around St. Petersburg and other parts of the day area. Bay Area, excuse me, as dead fish show up on all of our shores. Today, dozens of people are expected to protest on the St. Pete Pier. That's where Nico Clemens is right now. Nico, these people are demanding some accountability from our elected officials. Yeah, Evan, the group that's coming to the St. Pete Pier today, they're going to a rally against Red Tide. They're marching for millions without a voice. That's what they say, marching for millions without a voice. Unfortunately, this right here is something we've gotten used to over the last several weeks, rotting fish here in the water. But the Suncoast Surf Rider Foundation organized the rally. The chair says it was cries from the community that prompted today's rally. He's hoping the group can discuss how to solve the issue, but ultimately says leaders on the state level need to step up. The group is calling on Governor DeSantis to declare this an environmental disaster. Let's get together. Let's 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 be a collective voice and let's rally for those that don't have a voice and make some demands to our governor right now for how we can stop this. And the rally against Red Tide, it starts at 10. Uh, right here at St. Pete Pier, though, uh, march north and uh, a couple of miles north, and that's where they'll end. But it starts here at St. Pete Pier at 10 o'clock, Evan. You know, just looking at that video right there, and a Corey was zooming in on the flies around the fish. Tell me what it's like right there. Is it bothering you, your, your nose, your eyes? It's certainly bothering, you know, we've had reporters cover Red Tide the last several weeks, month now, Christine McClarty, Olivia Steen, and they've talked about that smell. Yeah. And you don't even have to be close to it, but we're, we're up against the, the, the yeah. pier here, and the smell is just, it's really hard to breathe, believe it or not, it's really hard to breathe out here with that smell. So mm. I can imagine people here at the pier pulling up, they, you know, they, they may not be out here for too long. Certainly not good for tourism, nor for homeowners, it's just not good all around. Nico Clemens live in St. Pete, thank you very much.